All right, good afternoon. This is Nate McGee bringing you our video of the day here. Today is November 14th, 2013, and it is a Thursday. What I have pulled up here on the chart is the Aussie dollar, Aussie US dollar pair here on the daily chart. And I wanted to bring something to your attention. A few weeks ago, we were discussing the Aussie dollar doing this last kiss breakout. And we kind of touched on a little bit about how the breakout, a lot of times their breakout is a fake out and people get stopped out. So we like to wait for there to be a validation of sorts if it's a legitimate breakout or not. And that's based solely off the retouch principle of a breakout. So as you can see right here, we're in this range back from June to about September. We're in a decent range and then when it broke out, we want to wait for it to come back down to retouch the breakout zone, which is right in here at the 92968 level. And we want to have prices close in a strong bullish candle. And when it first touched it, that was a no-go. It wasn't very strong bullish candle. This one right here, I did take a long position off it, but it wasn't a strong, the strongest bullish candle but it was pretty strong if it's really strong when you want it to close near the high for it to kind of confirm and as you can see it did continue to rise on up here almost got to our next zone at the 98725 area before it fell back down now what I want to show you here is that prices came right back down to the zone here again and they had kind of been sideways right here you can see this is a lot stronger a bullish candle then this one over here because it closed near the high. So they could have taken a long off it, which I'll explain in a second. But you see right now we're kind of in a bearish candle, which is understandable. So I'm going to go one time frame lower here to the 240 minute chart and show you what we see here. When we look at the 240 minute chart, we have a little bit of an interesting story here. I have these three different zones that I have drawn here. And you can see many times in the past how they were expected right here. Price came up and slowed down the zone again. Came up the next one, quickly popped through it and came back down. Rest in this area again, and now it's down here. Okay, it's down the zone at 92.957. And what's interesting is that it was a nice double bottom, which is a reversal pattern. We had a yellow tip doji right down here as well. Plus, we had no downside momentum either. That was still pretty strong bullish power from that down move right there. And that's basically the reason why I took a long position off it was due to that we are retouching the zone based off the daily chart. And we've come down here to our, our next zone on the 240 minute. And we have two strong signs that we could see this possibly reverse and head back up. So took a long position down here earlier and it's been moving up pretty steadily. We're still in the positive for the day. So I'll see how this plays out over the next couple of days here. First profit target will be right up here around the 9367 mark. And that's really what I want to show you today. Just the concept of this last kiss and how the retouch principle still works. And it hasn't closed below that zone as we saw on the daily chart. It's gotten down there, but it hasn't closed below it yet. So we'll see what happens here. It should be interesting. We could see it continue to head on up. Or again, we could see it fall back down inside this range here for a little bit. And that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed it. Never miss another value charts trade. Go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel to see more video of the day and trade of the day videos. Again, this is Nate McGee reminding you to trade smarter, not harder. And as always, trade with confidence.